In a surprising turn of events, NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has made a discovery that has astronomers around the world in awe. A few weeks ago, the telescope discovered the earliest known galaxy in the universe, but now it has detected something even more massive, a supergiant hole moving away from its galaxy at an incredible speed of 4 million miles per hour. This latest discovery has very important implications and has generated much speculation among scientists and space enthusiasts about what it means for our understanding of the cosmos. The James Webb Telescope was launched on a mission to explore the first stars and galaxies in the universe. In a sculpture stunning images of the death of stars and galaxies from a few million years after the Big Bang. We invite you to join us to explore the latest discovery from this telescope. If you are interested in keeping up to date with news from the universe and its surroundings, Subscribe to our channel, be sure to like this video and turn on the notification bell. The latest discovery is challenging the scientific community's current understanding of black holes. Black holes are generally thought of as huge entities that pull everything, including light, toward them, but the recently observed black hole appears to be having the opposite effect. Instead of absorbing light, it's creating new young stars along a long trail. This trail of newborn stars has been observed in the wake of the black hole which stretches at an incredible 200,000 light years away. Scientists are puzzled by the unusual behaviors of this black hole compared to others, but a team led by Yale astronomy professor Peter Banda recently reported their findings in the astrophysical journal, the Journal Letters. NASA's Hubble Space Telescope also confirmed these observations, suggesting that the black hole awakens new stars when it comes into contact with gas and cools it. NASA has made an exciting announcement about the galactic merger of 220, which was captured by the James Webb Space Telescope. This impressive galactic merger can be seen shining among other galaxies in the night sky. When two spiral galaxies merge, the phenomenon known as ARP 220 shines brightest in the infrared, making it perfect for observation by the James Webb Space Telescope. It is classified as an ultra luminous infrared galaxy, with a luminosity of 1 trillion suns, compared to our own galaxy in the Milky Way, which has much lower luminosity, about 10 billion suns. R220 is located in the constellation of the Serpents, about 250 million light years away. It is considered the brightest of the three closest galactic collisions to Earth and is listed as object number 220 in the Atlas of Peculiar Galaxies. About 200 million years ago, two spiral galaxies collided and triggered a huge explosion of star formation. This created a dense region about 5,000 light years across. It contains about 200 large star clusters. Surprisingly, this small area contains as much gas as the entire Milky Way. Previously, observations with radio telescopes discovered about 100 supernova remnants in less than 500 light years across. Then, the Hubble Space Telescope revealed that the Penalty's galaxies are located 1,200 light years apart, and that each core contains a rotating ring of star formation that emits a dazzling infrared light. The latest views from the James Webb Space Telescope shows an impressive galactic merger of the two galaxies. This image also shows faint tidal tails extending from the outskirts of the merger, indicating the gravitational pull between the two galaxies. Finally, the reddish and orange streams and filaments represent organic materials scattered in ARP-220. Another impressive discovery puzzled scientists. When researchers found primordial galaxies at the edge of the universe, they were skeptical about their authenticity. Some thought that they might be nearby galaxies in disguise. So they shared the data with other scientists around the world, hoping for the best. Amazingly, the James Webb Space Telescope confirmed that these ancient galaxies are real. Thanks to this revolutionary telescope, we can now observe the oldest galaxies ever seen. Astronomers estimate that light coming from these galaxies has traveled more than 13.5 billion years to reach Earth, giving us a glimpse into the distant past of the universe. These galaxies were discovered when the universe was only 350 million years old shedding light on how quickly the first generations of galaxies emerged. Spectral data confirm that these galaxies are at the edge of our view, some even farther away than the Hubble could see. The discovery is crucial because it validates one of the most important tasks of the James Webb Space Telescope, which is to study the early universe through light that has been traveling for more than 13.5 billion years. The ability to measure extreme red shifts is what sets James Webb apart, allowing astronomers to peek into the infrared range and observe the earliest galaxies in the universe. 
the excitement in the air is palpable, as this discovery marks an important milestone in the explorations of the universe and in an understanding its evolution. The recent advance in our understanding of the universe had had a profound impact and has prompted NASA to develop telescopes even more advanced than the James Webb Space Telescope to verify our understanding of the Big Bang. Using Webb's F spectrometer and near-infrared camera has yielded intriguing results, revealing the four of the original six galaxies exhibit extreme redshifts. This suggests that Webb is observing these galaxies as they existed 300 to 500 million years after the Big Bang devoid of heavy elements such as carbon. This is surprising since the universe is estimated to be 13.8 billion years old, and the existence of these galaxies implies that our understanding of the early universe must be revised. The scientific community is now concerned that these new findings challenge the current cosmological inflation model and the Big Bang theory, which have certain inconsistencies such as violating the laws of thermodynamics and lacking a clear explanation of the cause of the Big Bang. In addition, the James Webb Space Telescope has discovered galaxies that are almost as old as the Big Bang itself, thus challenging our previous notions about the origin of the universe. Renowned theoretical physicist Michio Kaku argues that the James Webb Space Telescope detection of ancient galaxies casts doubt on everything we thought we knew about the beginning of the universe. Previously, these galaxies were thought to be less evolved compared to the Milky Way, but recent discoveries indicate that we may have missed crucial information. The fact that the telescope has identified six galaxies at 65 million years after the Big Bang, which are up to 10 times larger than the Milky Way, raises questions about the accuracy of our current theories about the creation of the universe. Kaku explains that it takes billions of years to form a galaxy like the Milky Way, so it is puzzling to find such large young primordial galaxies. Findings from a James Webb telescope challenge our previous understanding of the Big Bang, leaving scientists at a crossroads. Despite this, NASA recently shared a tweet about a galaxy cluster that exists only 650 million years after the Big Bang, adding another intriguing piece to the puzzle. Astronomers meticulously examined the data and concluded that this nascent cluster is anticipated to expand and eventually resemble the colossal coma A1656 cluster. The location of these events is extraordinary and distinctive, as it is an area of accelerated galactic evolution discovered by the James Webb Telescope. Researchers can now measure the velocities of these seven galaxies, which gives them a confidence to confirm the interconnectedness with a pearl cluster. Clearly, our previous beliefs about the Big Bang do not align with our current findings. However, additional data from the James Webb Telescope could provide evidence that either confirms or refutes the theory. Exactly what caused the Big Bang remains uncertain, but the answer may be within reach. In any case, we must patiently await further discoveries, but the resolution may be closer than anticipated. What are your thoughts on these revelations? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comment section. See you soon.